Welcome back to Bubba Tools. Today in this video, we're going to be doing a uh, mouse review. This is a Bluetooth mouse. Yeah, so... it I have no idea what year it is. I know it's a Windows, but it's like a Windows 6. So very old. And, uh... Yeah. You know, I'm not going to end it here, obviously, but that's the exterior. Now, let's get to the underside. So, on the underside, we have this power button here. And we flip the power button on. It's on. This is the Bluetooth connection button. But for now, we'll keep it off. This is the battery slot. Okay. It takes one AA battery. Yeah, AA. And now, let's put that back on really fast. have it on this is a select there's left click right click middle click scroll and then another middle click for some reason so yeah plus this right here is a shell so if I take the shell off it's a little bit difficult to do but, there you go, one, two, now, the shell comes right off, which is weird, because that's not supposed to happen, and there you go, that's what it looks like without the shell, however, now the clicking functions are removed because it used these little notches to activate this metal like receiver here so when this applies pressure it uses some kind of sensor to activate a click and somehow it hooks up to bluetooth and bluetooth does the rest i'm not a tech geek at all so i have no idea but I'm sure someone technological would understand this. And the inside, like, inside, inside. Even if this screwdriver even fits. Wait, this isn't a flat head or a Phillips head. I know you can't see it on camera, but these are like hexagons. Yeah. <laughs> I can't do anything. So we can't see the inside. Oh wait, no, never mind, you can't. It's right here. There it is. Spring. I'm assuming that spring is there because it like can feel pressure. I know there's a sensor right here to detect surfaces beneath it. Besides, this screwdriver here is so small, I may as well just use it as a pointer. So, this is a sensor. This is obviously the battery case. That's another use for this. Can't believe I just dropped my camera. And, yeah, we all know about the power button. Made in China. Okay. Um... Um, that's really it, so the husk of it comes right back on, very simply, just a single smack, and that's pretty much all there is to review about this mouse. I don't remember what a year, it's probably something like 2001, it's like an incredibly old mouse pointer, but... Yeah, it still works. So, 
that'll be it for this review because I'm just reviewing random objects now because why not so yeah that's it for this one see you on another video